Ottawa residents are frustrated and they are angry. And they have every right to be. Their lives continue to be severely impacted by unlawful and unsafe events on the city streets, in the downtown core, and in the surrounding neighbourhoods. This is unacceptable. This morning we have begun implementing a new surge and contained strategy in our downtown core based on lessons learned over the last operating cycle of the demonstrations and new intelligence gathered literally in the last 24 hours. There are three parts to this new strategy. Number one, we're deploying a surge of police officers in the downtown and the immediate neighbourhoods. There will be approximately 150 additional officers dedicated to only patrolling and addressing unlawful, threatening conduct in the most impacted neighbourhoods, specifically Centre Town, Lower Town and the Byward Market. The second part of the strategy will be an expansion of the hardening of the perimeter in the demonstration red zone, the immediate area of Wellington Street in front of the Parliament buildings. We will be further isolating and containing the demonstration in that red zone. The Ottawa Police Service, the City of Ottawa and our partners will be utilizing concrete barriers, heavy equipment barricades to create no access roadways throughout the downtown core. This includes considerations around the closing of bridges, highway off-ramps and other roadways. Incoming protester vehicles today and throughout the weekend will be directed to designated parking zones outside of the downtown core. The third part of the strategy, enhanced intelligence and investigation operations. We now have secured fully national, provincial and local intelligence agencies. We have increased ability to identify and target protesters and supporters of protesters who are funding and enabling unlawful and harmful activity by the protesters themselves. Investigative evidence gathering teams are collecting financial, digital, vehicle registration, driver identification, insurance status, and other related evidence that will be used in prosecutions. The primary focus of each of these measures will be on the unlawful behavior connected to the ongoing demonstrations. This includes parallel and counter demonstrations. We strongly urge all demonstrators and those engaging with the demonstrators to act lawfully, peacefully, and respectfully. The hatred, the violence, the illegal acts that Ottawa residences and businesses have endured over the last week is unacceptable in any circumstance. The Ottawa Police Service and the City of Ottawa are bringing significantly greater resources to restore order, hold offenders to account, and protect our neighbourhoods. In closing, I want to reiterate what Ottawa residents have endured, what Ottawa businesses have endured, what our own service members and our partners have endured over the last week is unacceptable. And we have learned from our experience, we have gathered new evidence, we have secured new allies, and we're implementing new measures to bring this demonstration to an end.